A senior delegation of government officials from Afghanistan participated in a learning exchange visit to Morocco to learn from Morocco's business environment reforms that have been successfully coordinated by the National Committee for Business Environment. Similar to the CNEA in Morocco, in Afghanistan, the Executive Committee on Private Sector Development, PRICEC, coordinates investment climate reforms. Afghanistan is striving to introduce best practices from other countries' experiences to strengthen its ability to tackle more challenging business environment reforms. The Kenya, an institution responsible for providing a conducive environment for private sector, we have similar uh, structure in Afghanistan, which is called the Private Sector uh, Executive Committee. Private Sector Executive Committee, uh, which is under the office of his Excellency, the Chief Executive of the Islamic Republic of Afghanistan is mainly responsible for coordination and implementation of reforms uh, for private sector in Afghanistan uh, involving all government concerned institutions, the private sector and also uh, the international community. Uh, the main inspiration from this exposure visit for me has been that if you uh, have the political will and you have the right mechanism, you achieve the impossible. The moving up in the doing business index in Morocco has been remarkable. And that has happened because there has been political will and also the mechanism that Kenya is following has enabled the, the government and the economy in, in Morocco to achieve that remarkable achievement. That we will advocate for some changes in the structure of the price sector in Afghanistan. And I believe uh, that uh, looking into the Morocco model, if we bring those changes, which are not very big, uh, uh, I'm sure the work of the private sector executive committee will be more productive and useful. We are lacking um, uh, a very strong consultation process with the business community to draft a law in regulation or to amend the law in regulation. The stark difference that I noticed between Afghanistan and Morocco in terms of bringing reform and the structures within which the reforms are brought is the perception of the consultative process between stakeholders. So the, the consultative mechanisms between private sector and government in Morocco is so well embedded that any law that is enacted or before that developed and drafted enjoys the support of all sides. Effective and meaningful engagement of private sector in the decision making. Second is uh, active role of private sector in the consultation processes of the government for any policies which are related to the private sector development in the country. But we want to uh, somehow improve the role of the business community to not only be the, the member of the consultation or the advisory member of the um, economic or, or committees or groups, but also can have a strong voice in order to bring changes and reforms to the um, policies and regulations. That needs to do more to enable the environment, to turn the environment that works against the private sector to one that is conducive and also facilitates the investment of private sector so that the private sector takes the lead and the government of Afghanistan is at the background in a supporting role. The most important thing I learned from the experience of Morocco on trading across border is the dematerialization, simplification of procedures and uh, paperless practices is that currently we are working on export procedures in order to simplify the procedures for exports. Furthermore, we are working on development and implementation of national trade policy, 
which also aims to facilitate cross-border trade as well as uh, production, starting a business and overall uh, the private sector development. I intend to take the experience that I learned from Morocco trip to Afghanistan to turn this paper-based license issuance and turn it into a digital one, totally paperless, to help fight corruption, bring efficiency and also speed up the length or the number of days it takes for a single firm to apply for this license. No paper work within the government. In continuous contact with them uh, uh, to share with us the details of uh, their work so that we can win, particularly when we are going to the implementation phase, probably we will have lots of questions. Uh, so that is the relation that I would like to see, that we keep uh, uh, in touch with uh, different institutions here in Morocco. As a Morocco Morocco, who is in the country, سفری که ما با مراکو داشتیم به هدف کسب تجارب بیشتر از پیشرفت هایی که داره خصوص اصلاحات داشتن جدن قدرتانی میکنم از کشور مراکش به خاطر میمان نوازی به ای بر... از این برنامه تشکر میکنم شکرم